Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to sell the Spore Finance token using your Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. So it is a little bit different than when you have to buy it, but a lot of it will already be set up because you've already purchased it. So first things first, all you guys have to do to sell your Spore Finance is head over to your Trust Wallet and open that up. Once you guys are in your Trust Wallet here, all you guys have to do is head over to your browser and then go over to PancakeSwap. Now your wallet should already be connected because you purchased it, so you should be good to go there. And you shouldn't have to add the contract address again for your Spore Finance. Uh, but just in case that you do, I will have the BSE scan or coin market cap linked in the description if you guys need to copy the address over again. Uh, but if you click on where it says BNB right here and just search for Spore, it should already come up for you because you've already added it. Uh, now, you just want to click on Spore from the from amount, just like I did there. And you want to click on Select a Currency for the to amount and click on BNB. Now, all you guys have to do is decide how much Spore that you guys want to sell into BNB. So let's just say if I wanted to do 2,500 Spore, I can go ahead and type that in. And then what you guys want to do as well is ensure that your slippage tolerance is on 12%. If you need to change your slippage tolerance, just go ahead where those three lines are at the top. Click on that and just change your slippage tolerance to 12%. But once you guys put the amount of spore that you want to sell, you can just click on where it says insufficient spore balance for me because I don't have any spore in this wallet. But if you did, it would let you go through with the transaction and it will show you a more broken down version of your transaction in the next page, just showing you your fees and your exchange rates and things like that. So make sure you guys understand that before you go ahead with the transaction. Uh, but once you guys do that, you can then exit out of here and head over to your wallet. You will then see your BNB in your smart chain wallet. Once the BNB is in your smart chain wallet here, you can go ahead over to the Binance application. That is the application that I use to sell. And what you guys want to do here is you guys will be on the home screen right here. What you guys want to do is head over to wallets and just search for BNB, just like I have here. Once you guys click on BNB in your wallets, you want to click on deposit and continue. I just want to make sure that you guys are on the BEP20 network, the BSC network, the Binance Smart Chain. Make sure you send it to that address because you are sending it from a Smart Chain wallet from your Trust Wallet. It's very, very important. So what you guys want to do now is you just want to copy this BNB deposit address from here. And you want to exit out back over to your Trust Wallet. And what you guys want to do now is you want to scroll down until you find your Smart Chain wallet with your BNB in it. Click on Smart Chain, click on Send. And then you want to paste that address that we just got from Binance into the recipient address. So we just go ahead and paste that. And then you have to type the amount of BNB that you want to send over. Now, if you just sold all your spore, the spore that you want to sell, and you just want to send the max amount of BNB, just go ahead and click on max. But if you want to type in a certain amount of BNB, you can do that as well. So let's just say if we wanted to put in 2.5 BNB, it would then show us the uh, amount it is. So we can just go ahead and click on next. And then it will show us here that uh, our max total, our fee, and just confirm the address if you want to double check. Uh, once you guys are good there, uh, it just tells me on the bottom here to top up my smart chain because I don't have any BNB in this wallet. But if you have the correct amount of BNB that you're trying to send, it will then allow you to confirm this here. And then usually in about two to five minutes, you should have your BNB in your BNB wallet on Binance. And then of course, from there, you can go ahead and transfer that to USDT or transfer that to a different cryptocurrency if you would like to. Uh, now, if you guys need another tutorial showing you guys how to deposit into your bank account from BNB and Binance, just let me know. But it is pretty straightforward and easy from there. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to sell your Spore Finance token in exchange for BNB on the Trust Wallet. If this video did help you out, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.